literally making Hollywood stops. <laughs> I don't care. Okay, I don't care. I need to get to this appointment. Okay guys, so I got my nails taken off, um, which is very unfortunate, only because I did not want to get them taken off. Um, about two to three weeks ago on the news, local news, and it might have been on CNN, I'm not sure, but I know on local news where I live, um, there was a story of a woman who got cancer, basically, in her nails, in, in her fingers, um, due to an infection that she got at a nail salon. And this prompted, I guess, further research or something, and I would say a week after that story broke at the local news station, then there was another story by um, you know, a scientist guy who did studies, research on those blue light, UV lights that they use to dry your fingernails super duper quick. And um, studies showed that that machine alone mutates cancer within your body. I don't get my nails done all the time. Um, so for y'all sisters out there who do get your nails done all the time, just be aware of the fact that what we're doing to our bodies, you know, any type of cosmetic work, even if it's just getting our nails done, simple things um, can be harmful. So I called my nail salon a week ago and I asked them specifically, I said, hey, I don't wanna use that UV light <laughs> to, to dry my nails, I need a fill can you guys still do my nails with the fill? And then, you know, they just dry with the fans, the regular fans that they have. Oh, yes, yes, sure, yeah, but yeah, we'll, we'll go ahead and do that for you. I was like, okay, cool. Set up the appointment, went in for my appointment. I was getting a pedicure alongside, about to get my nails done. And the guy who was doing the, or who was gonna do the fill completely basically said, no, we can't do the fill without you doing the UV lights, um, which I knew was a bunch of bullshit. He was just being lazy about it. So I was like, okay, then take my fucking nails off, basically. Take the damn nails off. And he was like, oh, well, you know, people get their nails done all the time with the UV light. I don't know what the big deal is. And I said, you know what? People smoke all the time, too, and they still know the consequences of smoking cigarettes. So I said, that doesn't matter. People choose to smoke. People choose not to smoke. But... I don't want to use the UV light because of these particular circumstances and because of the study that was that has found that um, the UV light contributes to the mutation of cancer within the body. So I'm good. <laughs> and he just, you know, they started talking their language or he started talking his language, I guess, to his other um, counterparts. And I'm sure they're talking shit. I do not care.
Y'all, that massage, it was A1. I can't lie, it was, it was, it was good. It was good, y'all. I go to, um, and I'll put the link in the description, but I go to a massager. Um, her name is Adi. Can I fucking go? And um, she's at Piedmont Springs here in Oakland. Okay, I can go. Now, she's amazing. She gives the best massages overall. Deep tissue, top tier, especially prenatal massages are fucking amazing. Freaking amazing. You can get a piece in there like in the store if you want. And I gave them the jewels, they set it up, I got a morning. I bought a new bed, I got it, I went to watch the tone. Taking these jewels, I'm gonna be up until the morning. Damn, jewels too hard, I'm stuck too close. We gon' fuck around, drown. Off this way, I'm going out and show them. I've been on the road, I don't care why I do it. I'm gonna stop getting paid. Okay, so one of the first items I got was this um, stroller. So it's an infant car seat and stroller by Graco. Um, with my six-year-old, I remember we got the, I think it was the Chico brand, but we decided to do the Graco brand this time. So it comes with the, um, the car seat base, <sighs> infant car seat, which is right here. Um, I purchased this insert um, just for like a headrest for Hunter um, from Amazon.com. I purchased the car seat stroller um, and the uh, car seat base, which all came pretty much together uh, from Amazon.com as well. So I'll put a little box showing uh, the name of it, model and the price also for this as well and we got this little cute um, kind of toy that you put around the car seat uh, handle that also came from amazon.com and that's the five-in-one multi-use cover which you can put or place over the car seat nursing cover cart cover high chair cover and infinity scarf so I got it in this black and white stripe color. I uh, got this as well, which is really nice. And this part right here detaches. Um, so say if I want to put my wallet, some cards, cash, phone in here. If I, we go into a store and I need to leave the stroller outside of the store, I can go ahead and detach this part of it and just take it with me. Um, I got this from Target. I have it in a caramel color, including a black color. I have two wraps. I got those from Target. And then we have the Nano Baby um, silicone bottles. This is for zero plus months, five ounces, three bottles in one box. And I got these from um, Target as well. Also have these Komotomo baby bottles one is um, a pack in eight ounces and then the other is in five ounces and I got those from Amazon another item I have is the munchkin full dry rack to dry the baby's pacifiers bottle parts also the breastfeeding um, uh, parts as well, like, not breastfeeding, excuse me, the breast pump parts as well, like the phalanges and other parts as well. Um, initially I wanted to get like glass bottles and I did. I don't know how useful they're going to be since I do have these additional types that are lightweight silicone. Um, these may be too heavy. 
So I'm just keeping that in mind. Um, I did request a refund from Target. I got these from Target. Um, I got it in the five, I'm sorry, four ounce and then also the eight ounce. And they said that they didn't want them back. I mean, they weren't, they've never been open. They didn't want them back, but they gave me the full refund. So I'm probably going to give them away to whoever needs them. So in my previous video, I told you guys that I literally purchased everything for Hunter from zero to 12 months and I was not lying <laughs> so we have a rattle right here that I got from Target not Target from Amazon we have all of his little pacifiers um zero to three three to 18 months here um I had other additional items here but I placed them in his hospital bag and diaper bag so I will show those items on a different video um but I did purchase these cute hats from Aaron and Co. I believe it's a black owned company and they have the silk um, inside of the hats. My second row, I have socks and mittens here. Um, a pair of these super soft socks are also in his hospital bag. Um, and then, like I said in my previous video, I did purchase um, his onesies from zero to three, three to six six to nine in 12 months these are pretty much all of his clothing and it starts from newborn zero to three three to six six to nine and this is all the 12 month clothing right here And then at this last drawer, I basically have additional swaddles that I got from Target. These blankets I got, which is Simca Rose, I got from Walmart. Um, this big blanket right here I got from Target. And I love this cute um, laundry basket that I got for Hunter that did come from um, amazon.com and I have one as well which is much bigger in my room but that's his so we also have the Graco forever four in one car seat featuring true shield technology it's a 10 year one car seat um so the reason for purchasing this yes I do have the infant car seat that came with the stroller and all that stuff but um we just recently ordered a 2023 toyota sienna which is an order build um and supposed to come in and said in three to four months we will see <laughs> but that's basically what this car seat will be for is for the toyota sienna yes we are converting from having a regular vehicle car or sedan to now a minivan since we have four children. So this is kind of like a mini deep freezer that I did purchase. And I got this from Walmart. It was super inexpensive, had great reviews. So we will be opening that up probably within a week before Hunter's arrival. And I plan on placing that right next to my other deep freezer, so right here. I did buy containers as well, which I got from Amazon, to keep my um, milk supply in inside the deep freezer. And Hunter's not gonna need these items just yet, but I wanted to just purchase them and get them out of the way. This is the Fisher Price, um, what is this? Fisher Price Deluxe Play, Kick and Play Piano Gym. And I also got this foldable soft foam mat. Both items are from Amazon. Wait, 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 let me check. Nope, this item, which is the foam mat, is from Target. And I believe the Fisher Price item is from Amazon. But they were on sale, so I said, you know what? Let's look at it now. Another item that we got that we already put together and I've just been placing a cover over it to keep it 
clean since it is white is this Graco rocker. Um, you do plug it up and it does rock back and forth at different speeds and it also vibrates. So that is that. I did purchase this insert from Amazon. Again, just to provide Hunter with some more um, head support, head and neck support. So another great item that we purchased was this movable mini crib. Um, I forgot the brand name, so I'll put it um, somewhere in the link. Um, not in the link, I'm sorry. I'll put a box to show where I got it from. Um, but the kids and I put the crib together. Y'all don't <laughs> ignore the spider under it. It's fake, of course. Um, we just kept that around since Halloween. We've been scaring each other with it, putting it in really odd places. And I did get this baby lounger in this light cream color. Also, this is super cute. Let me show you guys. We got this super adorable Hunter Julian plaque. Um, we're going to place his footprints here in the once we're in the hospital. But we got this cute plaque. This came from Etsy. Um, I do every once in a while want to hear my baby's heartbeat. So I did get this baby Doppler by Sonaline Plus. And it came from um, the FSAstore.com. And then I purchased, actually this was backwards, this Medela, um, it's a Medela case. It has like four bottles in it. It's for breastfeeding. So at night, you know, if I want to put it at my nightstand, it has four bottles in it, including this cooler, just to keep the milk fresh and cold until I place it into the refrigerator or go ahead and freeze it. So I did get this because we do travel often and this would be great to have handy. Um, I purchased this hunter green hat including a swaddle with it um, from and actually the swaddle is definitely doesn't 100% match the hat but it's okay we're, we're gonna work with it um, but I got them both from Etsy. I got another blanket here from Target.com, including another hunter green blanket here from Walmart.com. I've already went over my um, bedside caddy, so I'm not going to do that again. But I also have this changing table. I love <laughs> changing table that I did purchase from Amazon.com. Um, and the cover that's over the changing table is a, a muslin cover from Amazon.com, in, including the cover right here, which is for the mini crib. It's from Amazon.com. And I've been hearing great things about the Swaddle Up um, item of clothing for the infant. So I'm super excited to use this and see if it helps with um, his sleeping patterns to keep him kind of restful. Maybe, of course, not for the entire night, but we'll see what we can do with that. Another item I purchased was this small baby pillow, including, and I got the baby pillow from Walmart. No, no, no. I got the baby pillow from Amazon.com. And I got this recliner um, from Walmart.com, which was super inexpensive, like 300 and something dollars. Um, it comes with a cord, you plug it in and you're able to recline it. Um, it also rocks. And when it's plugged in, um, you just use these features on the side and it has a USB port. So if I need to charge anything, including it has a handy um, pocket. So I really like this recliner, plan on using it a lot. Thank you.
you guys but definitely <laughs> since this third trimester like even taking a shower even taking a shower you know just takes all of my energy away taking a shower is a lot and I get super duper exhausted and tired even after taking a shower to where I need water I feel like dehydrated it's crazy so. 